Small town, Wayne County, Mississippi. Authorities receive a call that a man's body has been found in his yard. The person that discovered the body, one of his own relatives. The victim's head was detached from his body. Welcome to Crimes Among Us. According to the county sheriff, Jody Ashley, a very aggressive, large breed dog was found running loose nearby and had to be put down as it turned on deputies. The victim's body was taken to Jackson for an autopsy. Allegedly, preliminary results from the autopsy would indicate that the damage to the body was caused post-mortem, after death. Then, story starts to circulate in a small town and on the internet that a 45-year-old African-American Mississippi native named Leon Hayes had been a victim of a hate crime. A Mississippi lynching cover-up of a black man? This left everyone with a lot of questions and very few, if any, answers on what happened. This investigation has seemingly found nothing. Half-truths, whole lies, or perhaps intimate details continue to circulate as Mississippi searches for answers. Some reports say that white nationalists paraded down the streets after his death. Another report that his death was an unruly accident. Reportedly, they want you to believe that he got uncontrollably drunk and his dog ate his head off. Many believe county officials are covering up a hate crime. With no major stories on the news outlets, no Google reports, and not even one picture of Leon Hayes, who allegedly had his head sawed off his body. Full decapitation for his relations with a white woman. Once this report is over, take a second and Google his name. Not one picture will appear. Search his death and not one truth will appear. Well, we, for the first time, are about to put a face with the name Leon Hayes. The year is 1967. Interracial marriage in the United States becomes fully legal, but not all states were so accepting, especially Mississippi. If you have publicly dated outside of your race, you've probably gotten some really ugly stares and the occasional stick to your own kind with a good old boy police force I wants you to believe that a ferocious head removing dog was on the prowl but do not fear they put a bullet in leon hayes dog and now the investigation is over they took out the culprit implying that after the dog surgically removed leon's head he also skinned his head this is a talented pup. Leon Hayes is your child, your brother, your uncle, your father. We are Leon. We deserve justice. Please share this post and force an outside agency to take a look at this case and do an actual investigation. We want justice for Leon and we want it now.